I just went to check out the um, like lakefront uh, picnic area of this nature preserve and it was underwhelming to be honest so I just drove back and I'm gonna go to my um, I think I'm just gonna walk my normal route to be honest the Sun's gonna start going down pretty soon I think but it doesn't close right as the Sun goes down it closes at 730 and right now it's 520 so I have some time oh my gosh you know what I have to do there's this other gym I want to get a membership at and they would let me film and everything all that cool stuff but I gotta cancel my crunch membership and the thing about canceling a crunch membership is you gotta pay like however many months in advance to cancel it that's whatever but also the fact that they keep adding charges you know to your account until you pay it off I don't know why they do that I don't know why gyms in general do that like why can't they just be like oh your thing didn't go through then you can't get in the gym that would be great if that was the only thing but it's certainly not they like oh my God. so I got a call to cancel that either today or tomorrow because the longer I wait the worse it'll be it's probably like 700 or something right now who knows honestly I don't know if they ever stop accruing like the interest thing or not but gym memberships are such a pain that's why at the gym i want to get a membership at for like an extra uh, how much is it like f i think for only an extra 10 a month there's no contract so definitely doing that because i'm not having another gym contract those are obnoxious but it's super dead here what day is it it's thursday thursday at five Super dead. I haven't been here in a while. And another thing I noticed is that every time I came here, I filmed. So, I haven't just came here off camera, I don't think. Or no, maybe I did, but it wasn't by myself. But I've yet to walk here by myself and just listen to music or whatever, which I really want to do. <laughs> from Amazon today, right? Very excited to open it, but I waited um, till I filmed it. Now, this might not be super cool or interesting to you guys, but for me, it's very important. Very nice, very cool. This is just like a, um, a suction mounted tripod for my camera because as you saw in the last video my camera literally fell and with you know the gimbal and the flip out screen those two parts in particular are kind of like fragile so i don't want to take any chances so i just got this which i have no idea how it works i just know that you like stick this on and then you and that's supposed to like get a secure connection Where's the tool? Oh. This is much more heavy duty than the last one I had, so I can confidently set it up in my car and not worry about it falling. This thing is like robust. Oh my goodness. Everything is secure. It is like not moving, but what I can do is I can just loosen that a bit and then I have a bunch more freedom to adjust this. However, in whatever position I want it in, I just, boom, and it's 
is like like Midas touch. It just turns to gold and it's stuck, you know? Um, let me try it real quick. How does that suction work? And I don't know how to explain this in terms of someone who like doesn't know anything about camera gear or tripods, but basically there's a screw that you screw the camera onto and instead of spinning the entire camera around to screw it on, you can adjust the screw itself in the mount. So I don't have to switch the camera around a bunch, I can just screw it in like that. This is very nice. This is a, like a unheard of angle in my videos because I stuck the camera onto one of the album covers and uh, it's not moving, like it's not budging at all. Let me, oh yeah, no, it's good. Like if anything, the only thing that could possibly fall is the album itself. But even then, like it's secure on the wall. So I love when I purchase something and I get exactly what I wanted and more. But this is actually by the same brand as this little mini tripod that I have um, is very nice and also it extends out like that so you can get a little bit more height. So I like this a lot. So it's by the same brand, uh, Ulanzi. I'll leave a link to it in the description um, if anyone else would want to get it for whatever reason. But yeah, highly recommend this. And the thing about this tripod is I can get more use out of it than just when I'm in my car because obviously I could put it on max and match right here. So eventually the pump thing doesn't protrude as much out of the base. So I assume more air is being taken out. Another angle that has never been seen in my videos. Is my room messy? No, it's not bad. I don't know why, I'd, oh yeah. I was about to say, I don't know why I want this angle, but I clean my room basically every one of my videos. So having this angle, you know, a nice bird's eye view of everything, be nice, you know, it would spice it up quite a bit. Not spice it up, it would still be like, whatever, but you know, it's different. So, ooh, this, is a, this was a great investment. You know, there's other things I wanna buy. I always constantly have like, how much is it now? I think it's like 130, I think it's like 130 necklaces alone in my Etsy, like wish list or whatever. So instead of getting one of those, I spent like 40 or something and got this, which I think will be a bit more beneficial in the long run. So I think that's a good choice. I can film in the car very comfortably now, which I couldn't do last video for good reason. Oh yeah, I also have like one of those tripods where it's like a monopod, but it has the three feet at the bottom. I also want to get one of those for just when I'm out and would want a tripod to film something. Um, I think I'll get that and that will kind of complete my little arsenal of mounts and tripods. Cause then I'll have this mini one right here. I'll have the suction mount for any hard surfaces or the car especially. And then I'll have like the 60 inch um, tripod that I can just use on any flat surface. I'm so excited because I have a book coming in the mail tomorrow. It's Heaven by Maiko Kawakami. It's a novel that I've really been wanting to read for a while. So very excited for that to come in the mail. I've been wanting to get into reading more. I want to be a reader. People who read for fun are so cool. And I would like to have that be a habit of mine. I have like 20 novels on my Goodreads account that I want to read. So Heaven is one of those. The synopsis seems really cool. That'll be there tomorrow. Also, I'm reading Goodnight Pun Pun. I'm on like chapter 94 out of 143, I think. Somewhere around there. And it's good so far. So I'm very interested to keep reading that also. And I'm watching Dexter and I'm on season five, but I have like no motivation to watch that show anymore because it just peaked at season two. I would highly recommend you watch Dexter, but you really only have to watch the first two seasons, in my opinion. There's great stuff that happens afterwards, but season two is just like a fever pitch of the show. And I don't think they're gonna be able to top it after that. So 
I might just pivot and watch Snowfall, because that's another show I've really been wanting to watch. Or Mr. Robot, I've heard that's really good. I don't even know what it's about. But yeah, this video equipment brand definitely knows what they're doing. Because this suction mount is like crazy high quality. The hold is amazing. I have 100% confidence that it's not gonna fall, that's a lie. When your camera's up this high and it's delicate, you can be like 98, but I'm not 100%. But either way, like the materials, like thick rubbers, nice metals, I think. The build quality feels great. Very, very great. Especially compared to my last one. Especially compared to my last one. Basically what I'm on the way to do is to head to the gym to cancel my membership. So I have a membership at Crunch and I've literally only been there maybe, I think three times and that's it. Yeah, I've only been there three times because I'm not really crazy about that gym in general, to be honest, like it's always extremely busy. Um, at least the time I like to go, it's very, very busy. Like, at, oh my goodness, it's crazy. And the music is extremely loud. Like one of the two times I tried to have a conversation with someone in that gym, I had to yell at them and like, I was so I was close to them and I still had to yell. It was literally like talking in a club or something. It was horrible. And I could hear the music leaking through my headphones when I had it on full blast. And all they ever play is Drake. Like you would think he owns the gym or something, but they play Drake all the time and they blast it so loud you can't even you can't even drown it out. And I really don't like Drake's music at all. So also it's just really out of the way. Like notice I said I had to drive 30 minutes to cancel the membership because it's really just inconvenient. I would just go to the planet instead that's like maybe what? How much? It's like eight minutes away. I'd much rather just go there and work out than drive 30 minutes to go to a crunch that has obnoxiously loud music, nothing's ever open. Also, I wanna get a membership to a different gym that's about 15 minutes away from me. And it's pretty much the opposite of the crunch. It's like a lot more chill. It's a very, very chill gym. The time that I went there, it wasn't busy at all. They weren't even playing any music, which I think is really great because because gym music, all it does is make it more difficult to talk to people when you're there. Because no one in, no one likes gym music. No one ever, everyone's just listening to their own music. So I love the fact they didn't have music. Um, also, it has a full basketball court, which is cool. I don't play basketball, but just the fact it has it could be really cool. And also the last time I went to Crunch, the locker room smelled like shit. They smelled really bad. And obviously it's like a locker room, there was, it was right next to the bathroom, but dude, <laughs> it was literally, it smelled like someone cut or lacerated a, a, some piping next to the toilet and it was just leaking everywhere. Um, it smelled really bad. But anyways, I'm just coming up with reasons now. All in all, it's just not a gym I wanna go to. So it's really the only reason I need, to be honest. And then probably within the next few days, I'm gonna get the membership to the other gym I wanna get a membership at. And that one I'm actually really excited to go to because it's very chill, um, no music. And I actually asked the owners of the gym in person if it was okay for me to film in there. And they said, yeah, like, uh, you know, just be respectful, da 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 uh, Wouldn't mind a tag once in a while. Um, so they're really chill, the owners seem really nice. So I'd also be able to film videos there very easily. Cause you guys tend to want to watch gym content of mine, even though I haven't been going at all recently. Like I literally go occasionally, but if I could go for myself and also for content, then it would be like all the more reason to go. But uh, I brought water, right? Thank the heavens. I don't know if you can hear it in my voice, but I'm getting over a sickness. Like I was sick the last three days, I think. I could feel it coming on too because I was in a call with my friends and I literally told them, I was like, bro, I have like a quarter sized spot on the left side of my throat and it's sore and I feel like it's gonna spread. And then the next morning I woke up, sore throat, achy body. I don't know if that's a cold or a flu, I'm not sure. But yeah, I wasn't feeling too hot the last couple days. But now I'm pretty much over it. It's just my nose is a bit stuffy and uh, what else? Oh yeah, my throat's like still almost back to normal. I missed my turn. Uh, well, it's 
the GPS's are for, I suppose. So it says 21 minutes now. How much longer will it be? Oh, only a minute extra. Oh, I missed another one. Got you, got you. Um, still only a minute extra. Okay, got you. <laughs> That's crazy as hell. Dude, it's fucking hot. But I don't want to roll down a window because then uh, it'll be loud. I don't know what I was thinking getting a membership at a gym this far. Like, I am not driving 30, like, I am not driving 25 to 30 minutes to go to the gym every day. The only time I've ever drove like 20, 25 minutes plus to go to the gym every day on a consistent basis was summer of like 2022. 20, yeah, it was like then, it was a while back. And the only reason I did that is because that friend I had a friend that went there and he wanted me to go there with him and I was like, cool. But he was a mutual friend between me and this girl that I liked. I'm not driving 25 minutes every day just to see some dude. <laughs> like, I'm not doing that, I'm sorry. So there's no reason for me to be driving out this far to go to the gym. Like, there's really not, <laughs> so. Bro, it is unbelievably packed in this parking lot. What's today? But oh my days. It is like, you know, walking's never hurt anybody actually. I'm at a gym, might as well, <laughs> might as well walk up uh, to it. You know, I don't gotta park all that close. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead in there and cancel my membership. Hopefully they don't give me too much trouble. Like, <laughs> like it is, there's a line at the front desk. I don't know why, like, What's the big deal? I don't get it. I should have brought a jacket. I think I'd be more comfortable, but whatever. Like, look how packed the parking lot is. It's absolutely flooded with cars. That was actually very fast. It was faster than I was expecting, especially for canceling a gym membership, because those are notorious for like, really making it difficult to cancel. Hi, what brings you in today? Oh, uh, I'm trying to cancel my membership. Cancel your membership? No, 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 no! What's wrong? Come here, talk to me. Why do you want to cancel your membership? I just don't need it anymore. Could you just cancel it? No, don't cancel it. Did you get hurt? What's wrong? No, I didn't get hurt. Talk to me. What's wrong? I, I just can't afford it. You can't afford it? Get a job. Do something. I, I just... You Maybe we can do it. We can take $3.99 off. Will that work that's for you? That's not going to do anything. The membership is $50 and I could go to the gym. That's like $10.99. Fuck that gym. They're not better than us. You this, need to stay here. They have the same equipment y'all no, got. No, please don't leave us, man. 
Let's pour something. Come on, I really, I really can't do it. No, you, you're gonna have to do it. Did you, did you wait 60 days? What, 60 days? See, what? 60 days, so you can't cancel it. You have to wait 60 days. Can I, can I, can I talk to a, a manager, please? A manager? Yeah. Oh, great, hold that thought. That would be me. <laughs> but it was actually very, very easy. Uh, I just went in there, paid the like fees or whatever something like that because i had a balance on the account because i was not paying for that shit uh when i wasn't going i don't even think i was in there for five minutes to be honest but yeah i just paid the fee it was like 244 it was like 244 or something i was thinking it would be more for the amount of time that i went without uh paying for the membership i thought it was going to be a lot worse but yeah, you guys were able to see it since I actually got clips of it, but it was packed as hell. Like, uh, I still don't know what day it is. But yeah, early in the year, crunch. Dude, oh my goodness. And this is peak hours, it's 622. My throat certainly isn't like sore sore, but I don't know. It's certainly not comfortable to speak. Anyway, let me get gas. I used to, oh my God, it is brutally loud out here. But when I first got my car, for a long time actually, I used to just pump gas all the time with the car turned on. So uh, that's really bad. But I didn't know there was anything wrong with it, but apparently your car can like explode. I'm always paranoid about driving off with um, the thing still in my car. That would be horrible. All right, let me get this thing off. I don't even like it being that close to my mouth because then it sounds, it sounds weird. Anyways, just double checking. I'm not still plugged up, dude. I could run in and get some candy real quick, but that would be one, inconvenient, and two, I'm stingy. So uh, for those reasons, I'm not going to get it. It's not even because I'm a healthy person. Yeah, we don't really know where he's from. He just kind of showed up one day and then we gave him food and stuff and he just chills out here. Susie, hello. Yeah, we're gonna get started. I got my racket. I got three water bottles. I got I got tennis balls, I got shoes, I brought a spare jacket. We should be good. My head hurts, probably because I've eaten a lot of sugar today. That's probably it. And not enough water. Probably those two. But yeah, I'm very curious to play, because you know, as I said, I've never played tennis before. So um very excited to see uh, how it goes. I think I'll do good. I think once I get the hang of it, um, I'll do really good, but we'll see. Horrible timing, horrible timing, horrible timing. Oh, I got the shot. Let's go. It's 523, so everyone's off work, so it should, there should be some traffic. Like last night when I looked up 
how far away this place was. It was like, what? Um, it was 15 minutes, but when I looked it up now, it's 25 or 24. So I'm like, damn, crazy. But we'll see. I haven't even played a sport in such a long time because the gym is not a sport. That shit is not a sport, unless you're a power lifter. Going to the gym is not a sport. So I haven't done an actual sport in a while. So turn here it is. Damn, that would be a nice shot. I see in pictures, bro. So every time I look around, I can see something in pictures. That's the great thing about it getting warmer out is the sun is out. And it, you know, it just, the sun reflecting off houses always looks really, really nice. Especially if there's trees around said house. It's a trade off, you know, it's hotter outside and I don't like the heat. But when you step outside, it's a lot more photogenic. So it is what it is. Okay, I'm here. Oh my god. Yeah, tennis looks fun. There's not even that many people here yet. There's like four. My head hurts, dude. It's definitely because, look at the sun. It's definitely because I haven't had enough water and I had lots of sugar today already, so. I'm definitely the youngest person here. That's another thing. I don't blend right in. Everyone here is like mid 20s, 30s, I think. Bro, is he looking at me? Oh, fucking hell. Let me try serving it up, I guess. Nice. Oh, no, that was out. Oh, shit. Oh. Yeah. Sir. Oh, that's out. That's literally out. Okay, okay. I feel so bad. He's running around trying to catch all these dog shit hits. Oh my gosh. Jeez. <laughs> How long have you been playing? Uh, I used to play long back. Really? Uh, like ages before. Okay. Uh, and this is my first time in uh, after a long time. Yeah, this is my first time playing ever actually. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, then it's a nice experience. It is. Yeah, I think it'd be fun once I get good. Here, you can keep these two in your pocket right here. Thank you. Oh, heck no. Nice. Oh, heck no. <gasps> Yo! That was in. Oh. Let's see. Doing it on my own. Run the whole court. Uh huh. Send it right back. Oh my God. <laughs> How many times can it bounce on yeah. once? Okay. Oh, please no. Okay, at least it didn't go over. <laughs> Jeez Louise. Oh, what the heck? Oh. Oh yeah. Thank you. Yeah, I was just gonna ask that. Do you know if that's yours? No, okay. that's not ours. That's us. It's not? No, no, it's not. Okay. Thank you. Boy. Sir. Oh, shit. Ambidextrous. Hell yeah. Ooh. That actually made it to the other side, let's go. I'm just happy when I'm able to send it back. Return to sender. That was good and it was in. I, that's going nowhere. Oh, oh. I. We made it to the, made it in. Oh my fuck. Whenever my legs get really cold, I can feel all the teller tendons act like getting all stiff. We can't even get a good match because I'm dog water. Like if we were both buns, that'd be one thing, but he's obviously not. Oh, what the? Is that in? Hell no. Oh, I didn't need two hands for that. Let's go. 
That's a point. You missed it, guys. I'm so good. I should ask him why he thinks that's happening. I keep sending everything to the left. Ugh. Uh, it's in. Oh, is that in? Let's go, it was. Oh, this is a good point. Let's go. I have mass, uh, mass anesthesia. Uh, anyway, I have this song stuck in my anesthesia, anesthesia. I have that song stuck in my head. It keeps repeating, repeatedly on repeat. Can't escape it in my head, but it sounds good, so I don't mind. Oh, what the? He got that point, but uh, I think it's still pretty close, guys. Oh, what the? Okay, that was just, I think he has one more. Let's make it a good one. That was not a good one. To the far right. How do you do that? Okay. Fuck. Okay. That's just putrid. There we go. Oh, I actually returned it. Let's go. Backhand, what the fuck? I wonder how everyone else is doing. How about, well, I feel like I'm not doing good. I compare myself to everyone else. That's a good idea, guys. Let me see this real quick. It's always so funny when it does that. I don't know if you can see that. I don't think so. Uh, is that in? It's really high. Yeah, it's in. Got one more. See that hand switch, guys? And I got the point, hell yeah. Okay, I just want to make sure we have them all. There's two in that back corner right yeah. there. I still have mine, yeah, you can keep them. Oh, those are his? Yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. might as well. There's an odd number of people over on the other side, but uh, I don't feel like introducing myself again to be like, hey. Plus I suck ass. 